into the second half then in this battle for Champions League glory. Alexander Arnold, Fabinho, Naby Keita, Fabinho now, Wijnaldum, now Mane, and space for the cross. The header, but far too straight to worry the keeper. Yeah, meat and drink for a goalkeeper of that class. Verratti. Mbappe. He's in here. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. So a throw in here. He's failed to hold it, Neymar. Mbappe. Neymar. Good defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Can they take advantage of the situation? Alexander-Arnold. Fabinho. Oh, a nice looking pass. Well, now in a dangerous position. Not out of the woods yet. Well, threat averted. Di Maria. And the danger cleared. Chance to attack using wit. And there is Roberto Firmino, far post. Keira. And the right place to cut out the pass. Salah. Alexander Arnold. It's with Fabinho. And Liverpool might be able to cash in. Well, possibilities in the centre. No nonsense clearance. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. He might yet finish. Suffice it to say, his edge is blunt. Poor effort. Well, he got a lot right there, but he got one thing wrong, and that was the finish. Great chance with that header, but he sent it wide of the post. Well, it's quite easy to head that one over the bar. This time he just gets his angles wrong, just past the post. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Well, PSG have hardly seen the ball, but to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. Di Maria. Mauro Icardi here. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. Well, offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Well, the referee remaining very much in control. Now the card, and it's yellow. Fabinho looking for Mane Liverpool have it all to do attending to his defensive chores Icardi and fed forwards and Neymar's lost the defenders the net is steering him in the face in it goes and surely that's the end of the story 
Surely they cannot throw us away from here. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back and he takes full advantage of the time he's given. It's an accomplished finish too. Oh, to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room if it stays like this, Derek, he's not happy. Just look at him. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Roberto Firmino. Here's Oxley chamberlain Fabinho. Salah. Well, that is how to run at defenders. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Can he find someone at the far post? Mane! Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game! And what a finale we could be in for here! Well, here's the replay, and it's a terrible effort at clearing your lines, giving the ball away. And from there, they never recover, and the coach will be tearing his hair out. Two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? One minute remaining. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Icardi. And he did well to cut it out. Mane. Oxlade Chamberlain. Moving the ball forward with purpose. He has time to play it over. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. And firing it into the area. Well, making high pressing work for them here. Well, nothing comes of it. And Thiago Silva could be in trouble here. Full time. Parisian pride shines through. PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, almost no words are needed. You just look down at the celebrations, the relief after the final whistle. Commiserations to the other players, but it's a celebration time now. All that sacrifice and commitment and desire to win a trophy and they've won the biggest one. Absolutely brilliant. This is what Paris Saint-Germain have been targeting for a good number of years. It's official now, they are PSG, the best in Europe League. Well, breathe it in, breathe these moments in. How many times you get the chance to stand on a podium, let alone pick that trophy up. Deep breaths from the captain just before he actually puts his hand on this famous trophy. The cup with the big ears, as they sometimes call it, and it's the property now for this year at any rate of PSG. Well, they'll be celebrating long into the night with their friends and family, and quite rightly so. It'll be a late night, Derek, I'm sure. A fantastic feeling for all concerned.
as they drink it in. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup, that's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken well you know exactly where I'd be sitting in that photo don't you Derek <laughs> I think I've heard it before Lee <laughs> straight in the front <laughs> chances